Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander perspectives are sometimes hard to include for early childhood educators and care and we might not know where to start. So the best way to start is with small steps as recommended by many, many uh, Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander experts, elders and council. So I have this wonderful book that is called Bush Tracks that can be used in conjunction with a bush kinder or any experiences that you will have in a classroom or on country. The notion of country is very important for early childhood education here, especially if you are working within the new EYLF 2.0 was written by Ross Moriarty and illustrated by Bala Ringi. So what is good about this book that it is uh, exploration of country and country is one of the most important concepts of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander perspective. Another important uh, thing about this book and this story is that you can use this book as a starting point for another wonderful practice that is called oral storytelling. Another important thing about this book that it does introduce symbolic language symbols that are significant part of us uh, of the culture. Follow the bush tracks over the rocks and stones to the coastal hunting grounds. Watch your steps. It's steep. What do you notice here? Can you see some animal? Can you see some tracks? Cut down a spear tree, strip off the bark and smooth the wood. Make bush string to tie on three prongs. Careful, they are sharp. Can you see any birds here? Where does this path go? Stop beside the creek to wet the soap leaves and rub them together to wash with foam. Grab your spear, there is a long walk ahead. What animal do you see here? What color is the creek? Wade through the billabong and pull up the lily roots to cook on the fire. Watch out, there's a file snake. Can you see the snake? How beautiful is that? Carry a fire stick to light the grass at the edge of country so that smoke messages people who belong to that land. Watch the horizon. Are they signaling back? Walk through the mangroves and spear a river fish. Look behind the furthest bank. Is that a crocodile tail? Can you see the crocodile tail here? Where is it? What else do you see? Dig under the burlashes to find cool, sweet water in the windswept dunes by the salty sea. Stop and drink. It's hot today. Can you see another animal and the reeds? Very beautiful. Check the face of the moon to fish the tides and hunt for crabs along the shore. Catch that crab. It's full moon tonight. What other creatures do you see here? Do you notice the starfish? Do you see some shells? Follow the stars on a pitch black night to navigate the sea in a dugout canoe between the shore and the island. Look up! Is that shooting light and meteor glowing? Can you notice that? How beautiful is the sky! 
Run for the cave high above ground when lightning strikes and the wild winds come. Shelter here from the flooding rain. You are at the end of the track and safe from the storm. What animals do you see here? Do you know what they are? What about lightning? Can you see the rain? The end.